This is the N2H2 Lewis structure. Nitrogen is in group 5 or 15 on the periodic table, 5 valence electrons, but we have 2 of them. Hydrogen is in group 1, it has 1 valence electron, again we have 2 hydrogens, so 10 plus 2, a total of 12 valence electrons. Hydrogens always go on the outside, so let's put the two nitrogens in the middle, and then we can just put a hydrogen on the outside of each of those. So we've used the two hydrogens and the two nitrogens. We have 12 total valence electrons to work with. We'll put a pair between the nitrogen and the hydrogen to form a chemical bond over here and then in the center. So we've used two, four, six, and hydrogens only need two valence electrons for a full outer shell. So we've actually filled the outer shell of both the hydrogen. So we won't put any more there. So let's go to the center atoms, the nitrogen. So we have 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, and 12. So we've used all 12 valence electrons. At this point, this nitrogen has an octet, but this nitrogen right here only has six valence electrons, so it needs two more. What we can do is take these two valence electrons here and move them to the center and form a double bond. So we're still using 12 total valence electrons, but now this nitrogen, it has 8, and this nitrogen has 8. So we've used all 12 valence electrons that we started with, and everything has full outer shells. So this is the Lewis structure for N2H2, and this is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.